With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, in this question is given that prove by vector method that in a right angle triangle ABC, AB square plus AC square it is equals to BC square. Okay. Then and we have to prove by vector method only. Okay. And the angle A, B, C right angled. Okay. Angle A is right angled. Okay. So let's prove this part only. Let me draw the figure here. So this is the triangle A, B, C. It is right angled at angle A. We can see here. Okay. So we need to prove that this. Okay. This is equal to this by using vector method. Okay. So let's prove this using vet vector method. So this will be A, B vector. And this will be B, C. And this will be A, C. Okay. So we know that resultant of two vectors here. A, B vector plus B, C vector. It will be equals to. What it will be equal to AC vector, okay? AC resultant suppose so it will be equal to some of these two vectors, okay? So from here my BC vector it will be equal to AC vector minus AB vector, okay? I have shifted this. Now add mod to both the sides and square, okay? So it will be magnitude of BC and square here, so it will be similarly written as this, okay? I have added mod to both the side and square, okay? So this will be same. BC square okay magnitude square it will be magnitude of AC square okay plus magnitude of AB this will be square and min minus 2 it will be AC vector and dot part with AB vector okay okay so you can see here I am having dot part of AC and AB okay this is AC vector this is AB vector and uh, angle between these two vectors is 90 so cos 90 will be 0 so this value whole will be 0 okay so from here I will write here BC square magnitude square it will be AC vector magnitude square plus magnitude of AB vector this is vector here okay square and look here this is what we need to prove using vector method okay so we have done half part now let's come back to the question here it is saying also prove that the midpoint of hypotenuse is equidistant from all the vertices okay suppose this point here okay this is point D this is the midpoint here and we have to prove that this is equidistant from all the points means it is equally distant from a point b point and c point okay we need to prove this so let's write here it is given that d is midpoint so d is midpoint of which side of bc so i can write here vector bc its magnitude divided by 2 it will be equals to how much magnitude magnitude of bd vector or it is also equals to dc vector magnitude now here look in the figure if I'll consider triangle ABD and ADC, okay. So in triangle ABD, what will be the resultant? Suppose this will be the resultant here. This AD, it will be the resultant here. Let me highlight this point. Okay. This AD vector is resultant if. So it will be equal to sum of two other vectors of the triangle. Okay. Let me write this point here. What will be the two vectors? AB vector plus BD vector. Okay. It will be equal to AD vector. AD is resultant as I said. Now consider triangle ADC okay i'm writing this part here uh, okay look here uh, look here in the figure adc okay so again ad plus dc vector it will be equal to resultant which is ac vector here okay and what will be the value of ab vector from here if i want to get the value of ab vector it will be equals to ad vector minus bd vector okay now look here ac vector okay ac vector this is equals to ad vector plus dc okay look here we have considered here look here dc vector is equals to bd vector so i can write here bd vector in place of this vector okay this is equal here so now here i am having ab vector and ac vector okay what are ab ac vector look in the figure their angle between them is 90 so their dot product will be equal to 0 so let's write here ab vector dot product with ac vector will be equal to 0 okay now put the values here ab vector is what it is AD minus BD vector, okay? And AC vector is AD plus of BD, okay? Both are vectors, so it will be equal to 0. Okay, now look at, look at this equation here. A minus B and A plus B, both the vectors are same. So A minus B, A plus B. A square minus B square. So here, AD magnitude square minus BD magnitude square. I can write it like that. Okay, a square minus b square. So from here, ad magnitude square, it will be equals to bd vector magnitude square. Okay, 
or what I can write here? I can write that AD vector magnitude it will be equals to BD vector magnitude. Okay, it will be equals to what is BD vector here? It is equals to DC vector also magnitude. So DC vector magnitude and AD, BD and DC. Look here. AD is distance between A and D. BD is distance between B and D and DC is distance between C and D. All are equal. This is what we need to prove that it is equidistance from vertex. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.